Hello everyone, myself Aruna Rajshekhar, a life transformation and women empowerment coach. Today uh, I'm here so that I can share some uh, basic things what is uh, required for any person to be uh, their best version of themselves. Uh, it's about 10 to 12 and which are very very common which we uh, know but sometimes we ignore on those. So uh, without taking much time I would uh, get to those 12 points. The first one is or you know it's like uh, 12 rules to become the best version of yourself the first one is be you it's yeah uh, you heard it right be you we need to be ourselves everyone are born with some good qualities and uh, some everyone has got some different interest altogether right so uh, and like how mango has got its own taste and nutrition lychee has got its own apple has got its own so every fruit has got its own flavor taste and uh, nutrition value very important nutrition value right so similar way uh, you know it is with human being also so every human being has got something or the other which the, you know they are born with some good qualities so uh, you know fruits doesn't do but you know human being always tries to uh, look like somebody else try to do something like others but we need to understand that everyone has got their own unique features own unique talent so we need to work on those or whichever we don't have we can acquire but uh, we have to stop uh, comparing ourselves from others and trying to look like others so be at your authentic self because when you are at your authentic self you will do uh, the best and you will be uh, you know uh, you will be giving your a hundred percent or at the outcome what you will have no because you don't have the stress of looking like somebody else so be yourself that will help you to achieve your goal faster because that's your strength second thing is that being fearless now uh, anything we start something new whether it could be any business any new job or whatever uh, you know we uh, do in our life any a new relationship or any a new collaborations every time we are fearing what we have our own apprehensions saying that what will happen, what if it is not uh, right, or what it, if it doesn't work, what if it doesn't uh, you know, uh, work towards my favor or in my favor. So what happens, like this only there will be a lot of questions and it, it is natural. So we need to, uh, you know, and whenever you have some fear about uh, something, that means it is, uh, you know, showing you that you are on the right way. Because obviously you need to be, uh, you know, uh, conscious of what kind of steps you are taking, right? So, uh, but at the end, you need to take those steps so that uh, you move towards your goal and achieve the, uh, you know, the achieve your dreams or the goals, whatever you have set for. Because um, you have two options. Either you keep fearing and don't take any steps or you take the other step. So what will happen? In any which way you are at, uh, you know, point zero. So if you take one step, 